This video is going to take you through completing packing on goods out notes having used tote picking on the stock app. So this is packing on the PC having used your stock app to complete the picks with tote picking selected. You can see over here we're in fulfillment in goods out notes. We have selected only show completed picked goods out notes. So if we toggle this off, that shows all goods out notes whether they have been picked or not. But toggling that on will only show those goods out notes that have been picked uh, and the trolley deposited at your packing station. We've selected the status to open, so these are unpacked goods out notes. They are open, waiting to be packed. You can see here we've got our tote references. And of course you'd have multiple goods out notes for each reference because you'd have got multiple items on a trolley. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to scan the tote reference on the trolley. Now we can pick up any item from the trolley and scan it. And that brings up the goods out note. We can see that when we scanned it, we've already selected that item and packed it. Now we can scan the next item when we find it. And we can see now that two of two items have been packed. If we needed to, we could select packaging. We could change the weight. If we needed to, we could update our shipping to a different courier. The delivery address is completely editable, or we could add in a, a different address. So we have completely editable goods out notes, packing on a PC using the tote packing on your stock app. Now once we've packed all the packages, we're going to print our courier label and then we'll dispatch. Once we've dispatched, your e-commerce channel is updated to dispatched, sends out the courier tracking code to your uh, customer and you go about scanning the next tote and packing that trolley down. So this has been packing using the PC, the Stockley back office in conjunction with tote picking on the stock app.